It's the Rampart Rams taking on the Pine Creek Eagles. The Eagles coming into this game undefeated, and they're also the two-time defending state champions. Now, the Rampart players tell me it's a rivalry, and they're looking to end that winning streak at home here tonight. Just that, just like Pine Creek's ready for us, we're ready for them, and we're ready to go to battle tonight. It's a rivalry that goes back for years. I don't remember a time where Rampart has ever beat Pine Creek, but it's, it's still been like, it's, that's what makes it, I guess, the big rivalry is the fact that we're, so, we're still waiting for the team who's going to beat Pine Creek. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Head coach Rob Royer has been coaching for 20 years and is a former Rampart grad. So the opportunity to come back to Rampart High School and, and work with these young men has been uh, kind of one of those lifelong dreams. And as a former Ram, he understands the competition between these two schools. As the big rival for us, uh, there's definitely that rivalry game, uh, incentive to win. Um, as far as the team, it helps us with our, our goal to make the playoffs. The Rams know the Eagles have a strong football program, so they will need to work together as a team to get a win. The linemen block. I run the ball, the quarterback throws the ball, the quarterback gives good fakes. I give a good fake. So the receivers block. It's, it's a whole team. But win or lose, Coach Royer will always be proud of his players. We challenge the kids every week to go out and play their best game. And we believe that if they play all three phases of the game and they play with a lot of heart, then the result kind of takes care of itself. Now the Rams were unable to stop the Eagles winning streak. The Eagles win 35 to nothing. Now remember, if you want to see your team on TV, all you have to do is go to our website, fox21news.com, click on community, then contest and vote for your team, and you could see them on TV. In Colorado Springs, Allison Mastrangelo, Fox 21 News.